Hello. Do you like shaving? Yes, I do. Oh, hey, it's you. It's Greg Tardif. Shaving with Greg Tardif, I appreciate you joining in today and clicking on a video that I hope you like. It's a cartridge razor. It's from Penny Shaver. It's actually from AP Shave Co. Evidently at some point, AP Shave Co. is doing this uh, off-brand company thing called Penny Shaver. They're coming out with these uh, single edge cartridge razors. Cartridge razors on Greg Tardif's channel. Ho, ho. Somebody spent a lot of time developing this for people to use and shave and get good shaves, hopefully. So here's the thing. Andrew reached out to me and said, hey, I'd like you to check out this penny shaver and give me your thoughts. Maybe make a video. Here I am making a video, sharing my thoughts. Ah, Chuck. Uh, it is a single edge cartridge razor. Interesting already, right? It has these rubber little grippy things for the cartridge razor user that would typically do that kind of thing. Uh, and a pivoting head. Look at that, just pivoting. Just pivoting. On their site, they're breaking it out into three different subjects of people that they want using this razor. For people that are currently shaving with a cartridge razor, they want people to use this instead because it causes less irritation cost less money and it doesn't clog no clogging like the dance i'm assuming no it doesn't clog with like the soap the soap it doesn't clog with the soap apparently or less clogging i could probably get it to clog i've cooked up some tasty thick lather in my days that could clog this sob okay and then for the electric razor shaver shaver razor guys like that uses these foil ones switch into this you don't need, you don't need electricity for this. Huh? You could do this back in, when they didn't have electricity, back in the 1970s, I think. They didn't have electricity then. It's a newer, newer invention. That's not true. It also states that you can get a closer shave using their cartridges, maybe. And for wet shavers, okay? For wet shavers, me, I am a wet shaver. I love, Shaving with safety razors. I love shaving with injector blade razors, shave bats, etc. All right, it's TSA approved. I can travel with this on my carry-on bag and say, this is my razor. There are many like it, but this one is mine, okay? Well, I'm kind of viewing it from that perspective. I think the penny shaver is going after too many people all at once. Now, this costs about $20 for a handle and five cartridges. Fine. My King Z Gillette, about $30 if you buy it at Walgreens. Pack of 10 blades is what, $2 or something? Cool, it's almost about the same price. They say the cartridges should get you about 10 shakes. 10 shakes, 10. That's five and five. 10 shaves, look at triangle, with a big asterisk underneath that claim. The first shave will be a lot more aggressive because they over sharpen the blade. I've had this for a couple weeks now, shaved with it about six times. The first three shaves were super aggressive to me and the first two shaves really irritated my skin a lot. And I just did one single pass. As a wet shaver, that is preparing to travel and taking this with me, I have some issues. One of my first issues with it is the pivoting head it needs a little bit more resistance for me because one, my safety razors don't pivot. My wrist pivots when I'm shaving, but this kind of just follows the contours of where it already was as opposed to where it's going, at least to me. As somebody that's gonna travel with a razor, the first thing, the first thing I do if I'm gonna bring a cartridge razor. Let's say I bring my Colonel Conk. I'm gonna change the cartridge on it because the last time I traveled was probably three or four months before. I don't want bacteria from three or four months ago that has grown into a monster of potential face infection. I'm gonna change that cartridge out so I have a freshie in there. So if I'm on vacation, I don't want three really irritating shaves. I want three really good shaves you know that's what I would like I, so for me I think there's a place for improvement because I do like the idea of having a single edge cartridge razor that I can take on trips with me not have to worry about getting frisked at the TSA line okay although sometimes not so bad for me I think it would be better if there was a cartridge offering of maybe 
maybe three to five very good shaves. I think that would be fine. I would be good with that. But I, I can see why a cartridge razor shaver would want 10 shaves out of a cartridge. They usually use them for too long anyways, from what I understand from my friends. My friends. Can, can somebody that shaves with a cartridge razor really be friends with somebody that's a wet shaver? I think so. But my friends typically stretch it out for a little while. And having the longevity on the razor for electric shaver razor, electric razor shavers? <laughs> electric razor shavers, it's so much fun to say. Try saying electric razor shaver. I'll wait. Electric razor shaver. These things last for a long time before you have to replace anything. This is a foil one. Now, as somebody that has this and has shaved with it, um, I do like this on trips as well, but I don't know that this gives a closer shave than this does. I think it would give a closer shave than one of those like tri-head, the rotating ones, because those aren't really known to give the closest of shaves, but this one gives really close shaves as long as you shave with it uh, regularly. Regularly. So for me, I think it's close, but I think it's trying too hard and trying to do too much as it stands. If there were other cart cartridges for wet shavers to say, hey, here's your travel pack of cartridges, I'd be all in for three solid shaves as opposed to three really uncomfortable shaves and then five more, six more good shaves. Because after those first three shaves, I've been pr getting pretty good shaves with it. I'll say that. I will put a link to my Colonel Conk video if you wanna check that out, if you're looking for a travel razor or something like that. There's another one that's available to the market that's not a mass produced a from a conglomerate that provides a really good shave and it's actually really nice looking. So I'll put a link to that here. Feel free to check it out, but I appreciate you watching and uh, hearing my feedback on the uh, AP Shave Co. Penny Shaver Razor. Goodbye. Goodbye. I stepped on a bunch of fucking shit. Should I start over? Yeah, I should probably start over. Let me just turn this up just a smidge. Just a smidge. I'm like super nervous that I'm gonna be like, I don't know, what the f**k? Huh? What the f**k?